Welcome to our Auto 21 research project which is entitled Intelligent Systems and Sensors. This video will briefly cover the traffic simulation component of this project. This is a 3D representation of Winnipeg, Manitoba. Street data was exported from OpenStreetMap.org then imported into City Engine 2010 to generate the 3D mesh. All data was then imported into the simulator which was built using the Unity game engine. The area being circled right now represents downtown Winnipeg. To the north is a residential area. And to the northwest is an area representing the airport. Land use is determined by zoning information provided by the City of Winnipeg. We'll now zoom in to take a closer look at traffic. The individual agents within the simulator follow a target vehicle whose location is driven by cellular location data. Agents of the same color follow the same target. The small vehicles represent pedestrians, which are vehicles who have reached their destination. Pedestrians are smaller and slower than vehicles. When the target moves out of range of the pedestrians, they will transition back into vehicles and begin chasing the target. As you can see from the time in the upper right corner, it's rush hour. This is evident by the mass of blue vehicles leaving the downtown area across the Provence Bridge and the large amount of red vehicles heading west along Portage Avenue. Now we come to a Bluetooth tracker whose range is represented by a blue sphere. As vehicles pass the tracker, their device ID, location, and time of transit is logged. The agent's decision-making process has a stochastic component, which accounts for the wandering behavior exhibited by some agents. We'll continue to follow the red vehicles as they move towards the suburbs on their way home. Here you can see traffic splitting, some continuing west along Portage and some crossing the river heading south. Here, we again see vehicles having transitioned into pedestrians as they have reached their destination. We hope you've enjoyed the video and thank you for watching.